Tensions have been mounting in Eastern Europe in recent weeks after the European Union accused Belarus of flying in thousands of migrants to engineer a humanitarian crisis on its border with the European Union, member state Poland, a dispute that threatens to draw in Russia and NATO. Shedding light on the standoff between Poland, Belarus and the role of Russia in massing troops along the border with Ukraine, General Carter also highlighted that NATO must be ready even though he did not believe Russian President Vladimir Putin might want to engage in hot war with the West. I mean, I think if you look at the two things together, um, trouble up northwest, as it were, and then trouble around Ukraine, it's a classic example of a bit of distraction perhaps going on. Uh, and if you look at the Russian playbook over the years, the idea of Maskarovka, as they call it, um, this sort of theatre that they apply to it, it's pretty typical. It's some stuff that's been going on for years. The backdrop to his comments is the tension between Poland and Belarus, backed by Russia, due to large groups of migrants amassed at the border between the two countries. Russian troops are also thought to be massing at its border with Ukraine. Britain has sent a small military deployment to see if it could assist Poland. The sort of um, hybrid playbook where you link disinformation to destabilization and the idea of pushing migrants onto the European Union's borders is a classic example of that sort of thing. British Typhoon fighters also accompanied two Russian military aircraft out of its area of interest, working with NATO partners to monitor the jets as they pass through international airspace.